What up, no YouTube? It's your boy Mile High Chosen One, and we are back here with another video for the day. And today we have a special one for you boys, man. Um, the other night, man, I was live streaming for the first time on YouTube. So if you guys was watching the live stream, you guys have seen this game. Now this is a hundred dollar tournament that I'm in, and it's the semi finals. Um, the tournament be filled with a lot of of a lot of talent, uh, professional players, um, just talent all across the board. And we are in the semifinals right now going against um, Spec Special. Very, very decent opponent, man. Very, very good. Um, you know, $100, $100 game. Yeah, I'm rocking with the 49ers, and he has the Kansas City Chiefs. Now, um, before this video ever gets started, man, please like, comment, and subscribe. I would really appreciate that if you guys can subscribe to the channel. Uh, we do have a goal of trying to get to a thousand subscribers before March. Um, now, before this video gets started again, um, the quality, this is um, the video from the live stream. So the quality may not be as great, but this video is coming straight off the live stream, live stream um, from the other night, man. Very, very dope. I'm about to start live streaming almost every night. Now, since I know how to use it now, um, and, you know, y'all, you know, come on over there and check it out. And I'm pretty sure you guys will really enjoy it, man. Great competition that we play. So, right now, I'm starting off on defense, man. I'm getting my stuff together. I see that he's coming out in a bunch of tight end set, man. I know, I already know what I'm about to get out of this. This is the number one offense or number two offense on the game, man. It's very, very tough. Uh, me, when I play somebody their first drive, I want them to pull out all their tricks first. You know what I'm saying? I want to see what they can do so I can have it in my memory bank, memory bank and, you know, try to stop it, you know, the next drive as we get a great stop right there. Um, so I already know he's about to try to do the delay fade with all the crossers. I don't know why this formation and this play is so tough and you have to do so much to stop it, but it is. As you guys can see, I'm running over there and then I'm bagging out to try to, to, try to stop the delay fade and he has a dot wide open. The reason why it works so well with the Chiefs is because Tyreek Hill, Hartman, and then you got Patrick Mahomes that's not going to miss a pass. Um, so right now, you know, he's throwing, you know, great dots. He had, he got me thinking about um, that the corner, I mean, crossing routes and things of that nature. But again, first drive, I just want him to do what he can do. Um, this was a great tournament, man. I only gave up, what, 14 points all tournament, man. So, and that was a dot right there. But I only gave up 14 points all tournament. I was scoring you know, 28 to 35 points every single game. Um, and Mostert, man, is the is the, is a game changer, man. Now, this is the reason why I'm playing with the Niners, because Mostert, man, 97 speed at running back. Um, he's very, very tough. Now, uh, we are in a spread playbook, man, where we have a lot of different plays out of this spread playbook. Um, this spread playbook carried us throughout this whole tournament. You know, very, very good, man. Um, I really don't like Garoppolo because his release and his arm is just trash. But when you're just running the ball a lot, as we throw a dot right there, um, when you're running the ball a lot, you just need him to throw the ball at least six, seven times a game, and that's it. Um, right here, man, um, the guy's spec was, was was pretty decent, man. Um, you know, he he made plays when he needed to make plays. Um, and, you know, this is why this game, you know, came down to the wire like it did. Um, again, I hate getting the pass downs with Garofalo. Um, but like I said, little passes like that he could make. Um, he could make, man. Um, this tournament, like I said, was tough. Uh, yesterday, um, we, I was at a thousand dollar tournament and I lost in the fourth round. So I decided to join this tournament. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and I don't want to tell you what guy was going to happen, but. Um, you know, it was a great, great match, man. Like I said, you know, you have all the top tier tournament players here. As you guys can see right now, we're going to bag that now. Like, I found the antidote to it. Um, in order to stop them, that bunch tight end across the route, you have to put your corners, I mean, you have to put them purples in 30s. You have to just give up the underneath routes and don't give up the cross run right there. Um, he got a great sack. Um, but yeah, but in order to give up them, you you got you got to check them, them um, deep cross routes and just give up everything underneath. Uh, make him dick and dunk you up the field and make him throw a mistake right here. Good run. Um, I feel like that sack right there kind of put me out of um, out of place a little bit on this drive. Uh, running the ball again. Uh, most like I said, most of the very good. Then you got Tevin Coleman. Then you got McKinney. Um, great three headed monster. Um, right here, as you guys can see. 
you know, all them purples out there that we got. Cause I'm trying to stop the crossing route, but then he gets smart and he's just hitting me with the with an out route combination with a corner on top of it, man. Very, very tough combination to stop. But I'm cool with that. I'm going to give up that all the time. Again, he's trying to throw the crosser again. We got that back. The reason why I peeled off that little drag route because I'm trying to defend the uh tight end delay as well. Um this offense right here is just hell, man. Again. You know, he's getting a check down, and I, I give him that. But this offense is hell. Um, if you know how to stop this offense, like, completely, uh, please let me know because I don't know how to stop it 100%. I can bag it, you know, bag all the crossing routes, but I'm going to be giving that up. So, um, and then, you know, that's going to cost me too, you know, on this drive right here. It's not going to cost me, but it, it have big play potential to cost me right here. Now I'm starting to send – edge i mean heat off the edge so he can't roll out anymore and i'm putting my other linebacker in the purple so now i'm trying to make it a little tougher on him right there he just made that play it's just patrick mahomes doing magic um you know right so we just still trying to lock up we still just trying to figure out everything anything that we can do to you know to, to slow everything down he got a nice drive right now this is before the half uh very very big big play right here as you guys can see we out here just completely like fagged it well not really fagged it because we is, we are rushing three but we're just trying to stop the corner the crossing routes as much as we can um right here just sitting now that's a right here i got bailed out right there i know that for a fact um i'm trying to i'm trying to take away that out route down because the field is condensed now so i'm trying to take away the top and the bottom um right here bailed out once again this is a good combination i never thought about this combination you got an out route with the corner route uh very very tough um, as you guys can see, man, so he kicked the field goal. I'm just going to run the ball, you know, to go to, go to halftime, man. Great first half, man. Great first half. Great first half. Um, So now it's my turn. Now what I want to do is, this is my idea, is to run this whole entire clock out until they get to the fourth quarter. That This is my ideal. Don't let him touch the ball again because I don't need him to fluke up to catch anything with Tyreek Hill or anything. As you guys can see, hit him with the RPO glitch. Um, got Tevin Coleman out there because I thought he could be be a little faster, but um, you know, just not fast enough, man. That's supposed to be a touchdown uh, right here. You know, get a couple yard game. I want that RPO screen to be a touchdown, not just a good ten yard game. I want that to go for a touchdown. Right here, throw a little out route. Um, as you guys can see, I don't throw the ball with Garoppolo a lot. That's probably what second, third pass. Um, you know, it's just a heavy run scheme. Um, right here, I consider this a run too because that's behind the backfield. Um, so. Everything is, is is to keep Garoppolo comfortable while we while we play good defense and just keeping the clock moving and running. Um, you know, I feel like I have one of the I go I feel like I got one of the toughest offense when it comes to running the ball. Um, different formations. If you guys are interested in looking at something um, new, get into that spread playbook, man. Look into that spread playbook. I know it's a lot of plays. I know it could be. It could be uh, overwhelming because of all the plays in there, but you can you are going to find a lot of unique things in that playbook that um, a lot of playbooks don't have, and you will always have an advantage when it comes to certain runs. Now, in this game, I didn't bake, I didn't break huge runs. This was like a typical championship type game, um, but games leading up to this, like my run was just unstoppable, um, unstoppable right here. We got to throw the ball. Uh, should I mm, probably got lucky, but he came down too far, and he had a linebacker, so he wasn't going to animate if he tried to pick that ball off anyway. Um, you know, running the ball again with Coleman. Uh, very, very good, man. Very good. Uh, running again, like I said, I'm just trying to, as you guys can see, we had the ball since we came out of the half. And for a fact, I tried to get greedy, man. Like, you know, I got real, real greedy, you know, on this drive. And maybe I shouldn't have, you know, y'all let me know what y'all should have done when a play come up. You know, I'm not going to tell you guys what happened, but I want you guys to see uh, how greedy I got. It's fourth and five. I could have kicked my field goal, but I decided to go for it right here and got stopped. Now, if, if I was thinking I shouldn't have ran that play, I should have just ran a simple corner route with, with the tight end. And, and I would have got a touchdown, first down or a touchdown right here. My opponent just coming out the goal line trying to make me use all my timeouts. Um, I'm getting the stops. Got one stop. He got a second stop. I'm going to call another timeout right now. And right here, he come out of five wide. I wouldn't prepare for him to come out of five wide, to be honest. And, you know, he got me in a bind. He had everybody open, really. Um, and that right there is what sealed the game, man. Um, great, great game, though, man. Great um, semifinal games, man. I don't know who won the championship, but, you know, hopefully he won because he beat me. So, 
Um, I appreciate you guys for watching, man. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm going to catch you boys on the next one. I'm out.